hi everyone uh, welcome back so this will be the first video um whereby i'll be guiding you now you can register an account um with the lengo app and now you will be able to log in and also in case you've forgotten your password now you can be able to reset and go about it so um, let's get started so to visit lengo app is a website uh actually a web app so you need a browser so um, for example the chrome microsoft edge your favorite browser so just go and open your browser so in this case i'll be using microsoft edge and i'll just come to microsoft edge open it and then here um what i'll do is to subtype that language.ke that's the url so you visit language.ke then you'll have this uh, this the home page so then we have this button for register so for those who are using mobile this is how it will appear so this will be the view on the mobile so just click on this icon and then there you will see an option for login and register so just click on register and then the rest of the process remains the same so when you click on register and you enter it will be prompted it will be prompted to enter your email and the password you like to use so the only thing is that the password must not have maybe similar wordings that are in the in the email so that's just just ju those are just security let's say security messages are so um, i'll enter an email a sample email that i'll be using for this um for this demonstration um, i'll enter the ambo jeff yes this one then the password i'll just use a simple password then uh, click on register so when you click on register it will say create for your account and send for you an email uh, so you'll be required to verify your email so if you have not verified your email you'll not be able to do anything except the home page is what you'll be able to visit but when you try to log into to manage groups or when invited and trying to access the, the invite link you won't be able to do that until you verify your email so i'll go to my gmail yes um, okay So I'll just go to this user five. Yes, so here is the link. So we are having Lengo, please confirm your email. So what you need to do is just to click on this link. So when you click on that link, it will bring you to this page. Then just click on that confirm button. So the next thing you'll see this um, notification uh, telling you that you've confirmed that, that email and you have signed in that that and then you'll be brought to this page. So the reason also to why you are brought to this page is because your um, profile is not complete. So you only provided your email and the password, but um, the system needs other details such as your first name, last name, uh, mobile number, and etc. So that you can be able to start maybe using the app. So you have to complete your profile. Um, but this one was not for the focus for today. So we are still focusing on the part for registration. So I'll just log out. So you see now you can register. Uh, so I'll just log out then um, so you are you can now log in so um, the system automatically logged you in when you confirmed your account so for logging in assuming you remember your password and your username and mine to so to save so just type it with the email and the password then click on login in case you've forgotten your password so here is where you come you come and click on forgot password so this could forgot your password so you click on that enter your email and instruction will be sent to you so you enter the email you used at the time of registration so i'll enter that email send recent link so this will send a link to your email and through that link you'll be able to reset your password so here is the reset uh, password reset email so just click on that and you'll be brought to this page whereby you can now enter the new password you'd like to use so that is in case you've forgotten your password so i think that's on the part for registration and forgot resetting your password so for login you just come to login and now the process the normal process assuming you know the password and know your email then you enter those two and it will of course it will take you back to this page until you fill in your uh, profile until you complete your profile is when it will now stop bringing you to this page so but as long as your profile is not complete it will always redirect you to this page so let me just fill this um, first um, and 
phone number so the phone number notice this is the format you don't you start with the zero seven don't start with the plus two five four you have to just use the format that is provided there if you don't use that you for example if i try using this um, like that and i try to submit i'll just enter here national id then if you try to update your profile you'll get this error please provide a valid phone number so it expect this format so um, just ensure that you follow the exact format that is provided there and you know, everything will be okay and for the date it only allows people that are 18 years and above are between age of 18 to 100 so if you try and enter a date that is not within the range so assuming someone is saying that they were born on 2010 uh, the system won't allow that so you are told that you must be 18 years and above so it can't allow that so let's just now just fill um whatever we want now so we are just updating our profile and um, let's use um, something like this we'll use 1930 yes 10 10 1930 then the gender is that um the id number that's the id number but it's also telling you that this number cannot be used because it's uh, it's already so like then phone number is unique so if you have account and you already used a phone number with it you cannot use that phone number again anywhere so I'll just use um, that different number so just click on update your profile and once it's updated you'll be the taken to this page so this will be like your profile so here you'll be able to see you uh, the groups that you are in you can be able to manage your next of kin so you can actually add that data here so when you want to add next of kin you can do that so when you are having a complete profile now you can accept invitation from various groups yeah but when your com profile is not completed you receive a link and you try to open it the system will redirect you to the profile page until you ensure that the, that profile is completed you can also be able to add a group so once your profile is complete the system does not have any issue with you so you can be able to manage your groups you can join any group you can manage anything so i think that's all for today so you've seen in case you are having issue you are trying to register and you're still, still experiencing uh, issues so we are having this contact us uh, page by uh, you just go to the language coke and this this contact us so the contact us you can use this form to send your queries and we'll get back and try to assist you or you can just send an email to this support at language or um to that so you can also call this number directly with your um query so if maybe you are trying to register and you are seeing some errors or anything so just use this home um, or this page to give us the feedback and uh, let's see you in the next video thank you